guidance, the um, opportunity to have a senior level person who can give you information and guidance, it just seemed invaluable to me. I've had some good mentors in my life and so um, I really like the idea of being able to provide back some of the guidance and support. I feel like my life has been enriched, uh, that now I have a friend. Not only can I have this person and see all the wonderful things she's doing, but also can sort of take me out of the bubble that sometimes, at least I fall into, and I think all of us do, so that I can learn about different perspectives on particular issues and experiences and stuff like that. And professionally, um, it, en it was enriching because um, you know, people assume that if you're provost or at some level of higher administration, you know a lot, but it's very easy not to actually have a more comprehensive understanding of what's going on. So first, I've been able to um, think differently about my position, about my role in the office. I've been able to get in touch with other people that I wouldn't otherwise um, been able to sit with in a meeting and talk to about their roles and their areas um, of focus. Time. I mean, being able to, you know, carve out the time and to not just sort of, you know, do you have the hour, but uh, do you, you know, is your he head clear so you can really listen and pay attention and not like pretend you're listening, but, you know, sort of processing uh, something that happened. And um, because when um, Nerva and I met, it was always such a joy uh, and the time flew, flew by really, really fast. Um, but I felt that I wish I had had more time and I think going forward um, that's one of the things that I would really suggest that people really have, they have to plan it. Going in I think it was a bit challenging for me because I thought to myself, wow this is someone who's the provost of a university, um, I don't necessarily deserve to have this person as a mentor, how do I, you know, like what, what are the questions I should have? Like I wanted to have the right questions, I wanted to have the right approach. You were very prepared. <laughs> Maybe overly. Yes, I would definitely encourage someone to participate in this program either as a mentor or a mentee because there's something to be gained for both sides. And I was often wondering who is the mentor in this relationship because I learned a lot from Tracy. And I also think that in a place like Brown, it's a large place. And the more you can build connections with individuals across the campus, the better you'll be in your own profession and the more joy you'll have in coming to work every day. I would say to be open, um, to ask as many questions as possible, um, because that's the only way you'll learn, to not be afraid to step out of your box, um, to also challenge the person as well a bit, because I think too, to get the most out of it, Sometimes you have to push people a little bit. It's as valuable for the mentor as it is for the mentee, and so participation has benefits for both sides. You want to go first? Friend. I'd say rewarding. Empowering. Impactful. I was going to say invigorating. <laughs> it, was, it was definitely a lot of fun for me. Very much so a lot fun. of fun.